to do a close up of my skin so you can see it. my channel my name is Kara Mary and it's Wednesday that means another vlog with Kara and if you don't know me yet my name is Kara Mary and this is Kara Styles where I share with you my upcycling routine and low waste lifestyle overall sustainable fashion and in today's video it's kind of special it's not just clothing I am speaking to you about skincare if you've seen my past video I'm gonna upload it right here it's like me sharing with you my skincare journey like I had a very congested cysts, blackheads, whiteheads, like all of this area here and in my forehead was filled with acne. I'm going to give you a really brief story but I suggest that you watch the video here so you can get the full details. It was a very tough period where I thought the right thing to do was to go to a dermatologist and even going to a dermatologist it made it worse. After that I went to an esthetician where I learned how to maintain a skincare routine, look for the products that my skin needs and understand the process of just overall maintenance and wellness for my skin to glow and shine and here in this tutorial i'm gonna share not the tutorial i'm so used to making of clothing tutorials watch my tutorials in the channel because that's mostly what i do here in this vlog i want to share with you my product review of skincare brands that i have tried out I'm looking over there because that's where I have all the products. I, it's four different brands and all four of them have I've had great results. Each one of them have a different price range. I've broken it down in this video so you can get the full details and are probably wondering is it worth it? Is it accessible? Is it affordable? Because I know with skincare all of us have different income backgrounds. I come from a low income background where I thought I just had I could only afford what my <laughs> health insurance could pay for a dermatologist and what I could get in CVS but I really took it upon myself to buy quality ingredients and not just quality ingredients brands that represent my values and my values about clean beauty sustainability and overall organic zero waste lifestyle that's why for my products i shop at credo beauty in credo beauty you get brands that care as much as that as you do about clean cruelty free vegan no testing on animals and all just goodness and that's why i love to shop there and i, I know some of you guys are watching this and you don't want to use essential oils you don't want it to have little preservatives i know that that's why these are like my top four skincare brands that i've tried and let me tell you something it is an investment but it's an investment for your skin to glow and Kara Styles is about just like caring and goodness and positivity and these are the values that I care about about helping local small businesses like this Etsy beaded necklace that I'm wearing this thrifted top this the earrings that are from Majuri like I care the same care and value that I put into the choices that I make those choices go into my skincare so without further ado let me show you these four top brands that I've tried and give you the review and the breakdown of price and all the details that you need to know about all of the ingredients and reactions that I've had so we're gonna start off with Osea pretty much saying it in my Dominican accent this one was the first one I started off plant-based skincare and I love it I have repeated this twice I didn't show it but I did buy like the cleanser and the blemish twice because I loved it so much it was smoothing calm the one product from Osea that I didn't like is the mud it's this peppermint tea tree cleanser it was so strong it's for oily skin and mine's is combination so if you have combination with very oily skin it might be good for you me personally mm -mm. alpine beauty is the current one that i'm using right now and this one is smells like heaven like you are in this field of flowers this botanical garden so alpine beauty does have essential oils it is free of soy so if you are allergic to soy this is the perfect product to try the cleanser moisturizer have been a really nice and a nice product in my current routine the cleanser does bubble up really fast and i feel it having results right away like taking off my cz cream my sunscreen it just comes off perfectly i love it it's sparkly too and the moisturizer goes a long way like instead of me buying monthly 30 dollars a month in a drugstore i am spending 70 to 80 dollars 
in one month's purchase that can last me three months like this in indie lee product i did i did buy it once and it did last three months but i didn't repeat it like this product i didn't have a reaction not really nothing negative to say it has no essential oils and let's just appreciate how i have written the information in the tiny text right next in the top hand side just to appreciate and celebrate the aesthetic of all these products because they always keep it minimal i don't know why but just go to the description box below i have written all of that information as well there if you can't read it so from indie lee i'm going to move on to the last product it's clarity rx this one my esthetician recommended and it is amazing their mask especially the pink himalayan oh my god and the moisturizer i've bought twice similar to the osea osea and clarity x have been my favorite out of this grouping and clarity x is really good because if you're not into essential oils and you wanted to have more of like a science backed research this is a great brand this one however the cleanser i didn't have much of a reaction could be because i'm so used to my past cleansers exfoliating more that their this cleanser was uh but overall this is my overall review my experience and if you want me to talk more in detail about certain product let me know in the description box below okay so do you see like all of this well hey hey okay you get the point all these empty bottles i've kept so then i can go to credo beauty take it to the terror box get my points and recycle properly so this is just like a nice great way to be environmentally conscious and make choices where you can bring these glass jars and recycle them for the environment and that's pretty much it that's my review this review has been in the works for the past two years because like i told you i know what it's like to be economically deficient like i know that whenever you see yourself spending like 120 in two products you're like <sighs> but as as i was telling you it's not just the products it's also the lifestyle and this is a formula and the strategy that i've applied to help me invest in my skincare and invest in products that give me results like i said so far i'm using the wild alpine beauty i feel like i'm pronouncing it wrong and i'm getting great results it also smells so good and you can go to credo beauty by the way credo beauty is not sponsoring this this video i just pretty much love shopping there for all of my makeup and hair product needs i suggest that you go and go to my description box below to click there keep on shining stars i will see you in the next vlog check out my tutorials for upcycling fashion i make this community of stars more shining and positive and looking forward to life do not leave without giving it a like comment below subscribe to the channel and let's keep on growing our community of stars to keep on shining in fashion